Long before he was a founding father, Benjamin Franklin was world famous for his work in electricity. One of his early theories was that lightning and electricity were indeed the same thing. It was on June 15, 1752, by many accounts, that Franklin took his son on a daring and dangerous kite flying mission during a thunderstorm in Philadelphia. The kite was made from a large silk handkerchief, two sticks, a silk line, and a key. Franklin flew the kite into a cloud, noticed unusual activity on the silk line, touched the key, and perceived a very evident electric spark. Franklin told the story to English clergyman and scientist Joseph Priestley, who recounted the experiment in his 1767 book, History and Present Status of Electricity. Franklin had also written about his discovery to his friend Peter Collinson in London in October 1752. The letter was published in a journal that December and read at the Royal Society of London. Having proved his theory, Franklin set out to find a practical use for it, which he did when he invented the lightning rod which even in this modern era protects buildings and ships from the dangers of electricity.